welcome back guys and today we'll see do you really need coaching to crack the entrance exam or can you do it with your own self study okay i had already uploaded a video about this but i didn't think that video accomplished in getting across my opinion strongly enough so i'm reuploading this and i hope that it clears the concept in a much better way now coaching is necessary because it provides something as knowledge okay regular classes can't compete with coaching because they provide that extra amount of knowledge which is not asked in your boards so all the irregular knowledge which you might not necessarily require for your board so which you might not be concentrating on will be taken and they provide proper guidance while solving mcqs but then again they don't solve all the mcqs do they they only solve a specific set of mcqs which the teacher or the professor thinks is important now why are you here you are here because you are in a doubt that can you manage with self study now why has this doubt occurred can you manage without attending coaching classes okay now why has this doubt occurred one can be the availability so there is a lack of availability of coaching classes near you and hence you are with a doubt that can you manage without coaching on your own second could be the affordability as the cost of undergraduate mbbs seats have increased so does the cost of coaching it has become a very nice business and uh, yeah it's a cost somewhere around 60k i think per year in some institutions and regardless of availability and affordability there are some people who do not want to give up their weekend time okay given the fact that mbbs is such a frustrating this thing some people find it hard to find it hard to you know sacrifice their weekends and spend the entire 12 hours or 14 hours in a coaching class so you might also fall into that category or even though you're willing to give up the weekend and you have a coaching class and you can afford it maybe you don't have the stamina you don't have the stamina or the endurance to sit continuously for 15 hours or 12 hours or 8 hours in a given spot and listen to a lecture continuously for that amount of time so maybe you have these problems and you want to know that if you can manage without going to a coaching class by studying books on your own okay now before i give you the solution like before i tell you if or how you can be sure that you do not need a coaching class let me just tell you why you do need a coaching class and how we can find an alternative to that okay so there's a coaching class now coaching class what they do is in case you can't find motivation on your own okay there are some people who just can't find it in themselves to study so they need somebody to teach them or somebody to constantly remind them how important it is to study and how important it is to dedicate their time so coaching classes do provide that with a teacher constantly reminding you and the teacher constantly teaching you so you find your motivation there and imagine if a person i have seen a lot of people who have poor concept grasping skills okay there is a concept they understand the concept in their own way rather than the way in which it should be and finally the foundation is not that strong and they end up committing blunders when it comes to the exam so maybe you are fall into this category or maybe you just want that extra knowledge which is not covered in your college and only if you have the stamina to tolerate it and you don't care about wasting your weekend time now both here the thing we are finding is 
availability in case there isn't availability of a coaching center in your place there's always online coaching centers and then there are satellite coaching centers but i think that will be a debate for another video where i'll discuss if you should attend a live coaching center or if you should attend attend a satellite or you should sign up for an online which will be available on your phone or your laptop forget about that so if you have a problem with availability there are plenty of other alternatives like online okay and if you can't find the motivation on your own and if you have poor concept skills then definitely i think you should look at going to a coaching but okay let's say you have cleared all this and you're still in a doubt okay your average or an above average student who has good okay conditions you have a good concept clarity and you have a good self motivation practice okay in this case there is a way by which you can test if you can study on your own from uh, standard books or reference books or coaching books or just by solving mcqs if you can clear entrance exam without attending coaching because attending coaching is not a mandate it's not that necessary it's for people as i said who can't find motivation or who can't find a proper understanding of the concept so if you have good conceptual clarity and if you can motivate yourself then there is a way there is a way by which you can but how to know for sure that's what i'm going to tell you in this video how to know for sure first you uh, let what we'll do is we'll try an experiment okay uh, sarp sarp is the short form that's used for the short subjects that we have in mbbs so s stands for skin a for anesthesia r for radiology and p for psychiatry so what you do is you pick one of these one of the four subjects okay pick one of the small subjects or you can pick physiology biochemistry likewise but the sarp subjects are pretty small so pick the subjects you can either read them from a standard book or you can read them from a uh, what you say notes given by coaching centers which are also available online or you can uh, read them from entrance oriented books okay read the theory of it again i have a video regarding why you might not need to read standard books okay there will be link in the description if you have the time check it out i think it, you'll find it useful now why this because they're small you can complete them easily so pick a subject i usually go with skin when anybody asks me i tell them to read skin so pick skin it contains around 12 to 13 chapters depending upon who the author is read those 13 chapters properly revise it once or twice and then try solving the mcqs okay so you have 12 chapters you read them then you revise and then you solve mcqs if you are finally satisfied with your score and you think you can improve upon it before you actually face the entrance exam then there is no need for you to attend coaching classes because i have seen interns who are currently struggling to manage with their posting schedule and the coaching schedules and their self reading time because nothing can counter your self reading so what you do is you read a short subject you revise it and you solve the mcqs and look at your score are you happy with your score if you are happy then you don't need to you can manage definitely if not if you feel that even this is a torture if you find yourself miserable at the end of this please go ahead attend a coaching center yes and always as always thank you for watching please subscribe and leave a like if you liked it and leave a comment on what topic you would like me to make a video on next thanks for watching bye